no major surprises here on the isolateral leg extension. We're familiar with how to do this. This is just one leg at a time. Now, if your machine allows for it, like what I'm doing here, I'm turning my hips on the seat a little bit so that the leg that is actually doing the work, that side is pushed forward and the other side is pulled back a little bit. I just find it easier to really focus on what the quad is doing and getting a quality squeeze, really drill down on feeling that contraction um, and feeling each rep as much as possible. Um, one thing you'll notice here if you look really closely is I was kind of half-assing it a little bit here um, and uh, not really fully extending that knee. So one thing that you can still always do, use the handle pull your hips aggressively down in the seat and make sure that you fully extend that knee all the way don't go super heavy on this one make sure that all the reps are nice and controlled with a pretty even smooth start as well